fell along the uh, railing outside the outer courts. Some young tennis fans, and they're waiting for Michael Chang's appearance on the practice court. Pens and draw sheets in hand. Autograph seekers all over the grounds of the tennis center. In the stadium, Gabriella Sabatini is uh, up a set and a break now on Ann Grossman. We've had three games and three breaks of serve in the second set. And here we are again. Two break points for Grossman. Sylvia Farina from Italy, and she just lost to her in the first round a couple of weeks ago in Manhattan Beach. She was up in the first set, had nine or ten set points, lost it, then lost the second set 6-0. She was really irritated about that. When she saw she had to play her here, I asked her yesterday, you know, are you kind of upset that you had to play the same girl again and you just lost her? She said, no, I wanted the revenge. And she beat her. It's a good attitude. Go out with a positive attitude. Even again, two all in a bizarre second set. We're going to go check in now on a tie break at court 17 with David Mercer. Yes, and we're in a tie break out here, Ted. It's Shuzo Matsuoka at the Andrea Gaudenzi who takes the opening set on the tie break. Let's go back to the stadium court with Sabatini and Grossman and Tracy and Ted. Well, things have been consistent out here. We've got five games in the second set and five breaks of serve. Sabatini now with the edge. First point on her serve. Points have been pretty much the same. Lots of long rallies trying to work each other around to finish the point off. Gabriella Sabatini with a little more firepower, but both head with a lot of unforced errors because both are such great retrievers have great legs, it's just so tough to get a ball by either one. not play <laughs> <laughs> elsewhere around uh, arena spirlea about to win her second round match Dido from france took the first set over shiting wang from taipei and sandrine testu also from france the second round match testu beat pam schreiber yesterday possibly be pam schreiber's last u.s mm -hmm. open and I say possibly because she said she won't ask for a wild card anymore, but if she can get in by her ranking next year, she might play. Sabatini here in danger of holding. <laughs> second round match and then the first round appearance of Todd Martin tonight it gets underway at 730 Eastern 430 Pacific Monica Stellis up first with her second round match and then Michael Chang playing South Africa Neville Godwin also second round action tonight on USA
struggling out here with Sabatini today because just doesn't have enough power on those ground strokes to put Sabatini in trouble. Ann Grossman usually outlasts her opponents, Ted. So consistent from the baseline, moves them around well. That forehand side, the stronger of the two. check in now on, on the grounds. Michael Barquet, who have you found? Teddy here with number three seed, Arantxa Sanchez Vicario, and uh, you just finished your practice session. You've been playing very well. You've got the five straight finals. Then we just have to work on the on the winning, the finals part. Do you think you can do that here? Well, I think uh, what it counts is that I'm in very good shape, and um, I've been playing really well, you know, all summer, and I came, you know, with a lot of confidence to this tournament, and anything can happen, but uh, I have a very good, you know, practice, and uh, why not? I mean, what it comes is to be in the final, and I would, you know, would like to see if I can go to my sixth final straight. <laughs> Always special for you to play here, isn't it? Yeah, I love New York, and um, I love, you know, the um, this tournament. I don't know. I mean, I always done very well here, and even it's, you know, a little bit crazy, but uh, I don't know. I think that people like me here, and I can feel that, so it makes me, you know, play better. All right, Arancha, thanks a lot. No Good luck. Thank we'll send it back to you, Ted. And Arancha Sanchez Vicario has Nicole Art, an American, in her next match. Maximum effort now as she understands that her time may be running short here. And taking maximum time in mm -hmm. between points. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Rancha Sanchez Vicario has got, gotten to the last five finals that she's played, but they've been impressive finals, losing to Steffi in the French in Wimbledon, Lindsay Davenport at the Olympics, Monica Sellis in Montreal, but I'm sure she'd love to come up with a with a title. It does show that she's in good shape. She's playing good tennis by getting that far. right there looked a little tired to me not all the way to the shot hit it off balance when you get tired your footwork tends to be a little bit slow don't get right in the right position been terribly strenuous. Grossman looks like she's been playing 12 sets. She's done a lot of running out there today. <laughs> well, now it's a break point for Sabatini. This was a 40-15 game. They're on serve second set on the grandstand while Medvedev is about ready to polish off Jean-Philippe Florian. Andrea Cadenzi winning the first set over Matsuoka. Matsuoka. 
Fukuoka, the top Japanese men's player, but there's so many Japanese women's players. I think there's nine in this tournament. They really come on strong. They absolutely love tennis in that country. Good program over there. <laughs> 